So if the coins in a particular tube are not dispensing properly, one thing to check on the MEI 7000 is if that tube is properly placed here, they're easy to pop in and out. Assuming your tube is properly placed, you're going to look at the coins at the bottom. And whichever tube is having a problem and see if something is impeding that coin. It could be that the coin is damaged, it has a rough edge on it, uh, someone cut it with um, wire cutters. Could be that you have two coins stuck together because something was sticky on one of the coins. So if you should happen to have a coin jam like this, where coins have gotten stuck sideways in your coin tube, the easiest way to get these out, take your fingers, cover your coin tubes that you aren't using, I like to use a soda flat for everything to fall in and just put this upside down, let them fall out. Now if they're jammed like this, the easy way to do this is push from the bottom. They come out, now you can put them back in properly. See our video on how to properly load a coin mech. So occasionally you will end up with a coin stuck in a coin tube, like a quarter in your nickel tube. It's in there tight. You can try to get it out with a, with a pencil or a screwdriver or a pen, but you see it just doesn't want to come out and it flips around. For that, you're going to need to use your needle nose pliers. You need to have these. Um, if you've seen our video on what to carry in your tool case, you'll know that you should have needle nose pliers in there, and this is one of the reasons. With needle nose pliers, it's a one second fix. So once you have cleared out the coins, that coin or coins that were a problem, you're going to take and put the cartridge back in the coin mech. Um, and then you're going to dispense coins. Once you do that, the machine knows that that's working again. And now you'll be able to hopefully put coins in the machine and dispense them to test it and realize everything's working just fine.